Hello, Cancerians. I missed you guys. I hope you're doing great wherever you are. Cancerians, you want a soulmate reading to check up on the latest energies between you and your soulmate. First, we're going to ask what's coming towards you, Cancer, what you'll be dealing with facing in your life, and how you're currently doing on your soulmate journey. Second part of this video, we're going to ask about your soulmate. Whoever it is you're thinking of, concentrating on by watching this video, whether you're currently in contact with them or not, first we're going to ask how this person is doing at this time and how they are currently relating to you emotionally. What's on their mind? What they thinking, feeling at this time? Especially in relation to your cancer. Universe, please step in to your very clear and important messages for the sign of cancer. For cancer's highest good, please. Universe, what's coming towards cancer? What will cancer be dealing with facing in their life? And how is cancer currently doing on their soulmate journey? How is cancer currently doing on the soulmate journey? And what's coming towards cancer in their life? Wow, Cancerians, this is you looking for a relationship that's reciprocal. Yeah, you don't want to deal with anything less than that. This is you wanting a reciprocal relationship that's healthy. Yeah, this is you not lowering your standards for anyone. Wow, there's somebody that is constantly thinking of you, wants to take action towards you. They're showing up as king of wands. King of Wands is king of action. So they could be either gender, whichever sign. Uh, we're reading energies, not gender. So King of Wands is king of action. Somebody is thinking of you constantly. Like they can't stop thinking of you. Can't sleep. This is them. Uh, wanting to reunite with you, Cancerians. Yeah. A lot of you are dealing with Taurus also. Water signs, earth signs, and fire signs. All signs are popping up here. Wow, oh, you deeply heartbroken over your soulmate relationship. You feel a great need to clear the air with this person. You feel like you can't fully move on with your life. Yeah, this is you feeling a great need to clear the air with this person of yours. Yeah, they're thinking of you heavily because they're showing up in your reading already. Universe, please show us. What's coming towards cancer and how is cancer currently doing? On their soulmate journey. Wow, you have other soulmates popping up here. Meeting new soulmates, new. Yeah, look at this. Three kings popping up here and a page. This person of yours loves you quietly from a distance and wants to re enter your life, but new soulmates are popping up here for you. New meetings. Yeah, this person of yours is in love with you, quietly, from a distance. Yeah, look at all these cups. King of cups, two of cups, six of cups. This person is in love with you. My goodness. But they're not communicating. Now the queen is showing up here. My goodness. Yeah, you see, tower moment happened. So there was a breakup between you two. Breakup. Yeah, you see, communication coming through. This person feels like they're going to have to have a lot of courage to initiate this communication with you. Yeah, you see, they're heartbroken also. This is them heartbroken. Yeah, this person wants to fight for you. They don't want to let you go. Hmm. Something going on at your job or business. Uh, it looks like you are showing up as very diligent worker. Uh, bringing profit in, very diligent at your job or business. Let's see what's going on here. Universe, please show us what's coming towards cancer and how is cancer currently doing on their soulmate journey? Yeah, this is you quiet, not communicating with your soulmate, thinking, pondering, analyzing, going within, using your wisdom, but you feel a great need to clear the air with them. Like you feel it's not finished like you need to say something of great importance to you this person is slow to action yeah you you left this behind you walked away from this connection yeah you left this connection behind um but it looks like this person wants to re-enter your life they're not able to let you go cancerians yeah 
You're going to be meeting new soulmates. Look at this. People popping up here for you. New soulmates entering your life. Mm. This is good. This is good. Let me see what's going on with this soulmate of yours that wants to uh, connect with you, reconnect with you. You know, please show us the soulmate of cancer the soulmate of cancer what is currently going on with the soulmate of cancer and how is the soulmate of cancer currently relating to cancer especially emotionally and what's on soulmate's mind yeah you see they feel it's gonna take a lot of courage for them to initiate this very important communication with you a lot of you are dealing with Sagittarius, Leo, Aries, but they could be any sign really, but this arrow here stands for Sagittarius. So no matter what sign or gender they are, it shows that this person is preparing themselves to find a way to reach out to you, to communicate with you. Uh, they're not able to release you, let you go. Yeah, they're not able to move on with their life fully. Um, hmm. Yeah, you see, they realized how important you are to them. The sun card, the best card in the whole deck. Yeah, they do want to put work into this. Yeah, there's a lot of uh, misunderstanding between the two of you. Look at this. There's a lot that you two need to discuss. Hmm. This person is wondering if there's somebody else in your life they want to find out. Universe, please show us what's going on currently with the soulmate of cancer and how is the soulmate of cancer towards cancer at this time? Wow, you see, they're not able to let you go. This is them holding on, not letting you go, not releasing you. This person loves you. Yeah, that's why they're not able to let you go. Yeah, you see, unspoken love, secret love, hidden love. They're not able to let you go, release you. They have hard time expressing emotions, uh, initiating communication. They're showing up as very attractive, very important at the job or work, wherever it is they work. They're successful at it, whether they work for themselves or somebody else. And they have a lot of people looking up to them, people who admire them for their accomplishments at their job or business. This person showing up as powerful, influential at their job or business, and also very attractive. Yeah, they want to show you some kind of emotional offer. So they know they have to enter with some kind of emotional gesture offer. Yeah, they want to see you. This person wants to see you. Face-to-face -face communication is the best way to communicate. But this shows me that this person is missing you a lot. They feel sad without you. They feel your absence uh, is affecting them emotionally. Yeah, you see, they feel a major connection with you emotionally and spiritually, like it was meant to be. They're not able to release you. You guys have soul contracts. You know each other from past lifetimes, which means you're going to see each other again in future lifetimes. A lot of you are dealing with Aries and Aquarius. This person views you as available, uh, very strong willed, independent um attractive yeah they're very drawn to you wow this is you very guarded so this person feels you very guarded emotionally towards them like you stop communicating stop reaching out uh stop looking for them they view us very guarded emotionally towards them hmm Let's see what's going on here, Cancerians. Universe, please show us what's going on currently with the soulmate of Cancer and how is the soulmate of Cancer towards Cancerians? Oh, what, what happened? There was something serious that happened that broke you two up. Yeah, for this to show up, there was something serious that... Uh, you feel you had to let them go. Yeah, look at this. This person wants you back in their life. Yeah, they're scared of your rejection. They want to see you. This is them reminiscing of you, missing you. 
Hmm. There's something that uh, shows up with very heavy energy. Yeah, look at this. Something serious happened. Uh, this combination clearly shows the Seven of Swords, which means deceit, and the Devil energy. It shows that there was something serious that broke you two up. Yeah, something very serious. Uh, yeah, uh-huh. This was no casual breakup. Wow, this is heavy. Cancerians, we're going to go into your extended reading and ask about your soulmate's true long-term intentions and plans for you at this time. Long-term. Then we're going to ask what they're hiding from you at this time. What they have up their sleeve, whether they're hiding it on purpose or can communicate for whatever reason, but the universe feels you need to be aware of for your highest good. And of course, at the end, we're going to ask advice for you on how to best handle this soulmate connection at this time. And anything else you need to know about your life, including new soulmates, uh, new chapters, new beginnings in your life, also your health, finances, business, job opportunities, family matters, friendships, Whatever it is you need to know for your highest good, they'll show it at the end of the reading as well. So can serious click on the extended link below this video in the description box below and I'll see you there. Love you guys.